guys this is mr joshy j and in this video i am unpacking the bruised banana retro arsenal away kits yep it's the bruised banana one so you got your usual warning instructions now delivery time for this one took just six days unbelievable wow six days to arrive <laughs> Just, just getting it open now. Oh, wow, look at this. Look at that. Wow, look how retro this is. So, yeah, it's got the JPC sponsor on it. Like, found like material, Adidas. Yeah, again, some sort of found pick material. The Arsenal badge. Oh, that's quite tiny, actually, but at the same time, it looks nice. Can't focus. Yep, yeah, got some writing at the bottom. Look. 2XL, which is literally more like an extra large. Yeah, the Bruiser. I love this shirt. You know, it's one of my all time favorite football shirts. Adidas stripes. Let's have a look at the colour there. Can't see any loose thread in there. Let's have a look there. Nope, can't see any loose thread in there either. So, so far, so good on this side. Now, I've got to say, the retro couple shirts are usually more better on the DH skates than the modern day couple shirts. It's weird. Right, we do have a player's name on the back of this, and I could only think of one player to choose. One iconic player, what would wear this shirt? Just turn it around. Three, two, one. Yep. Number eight, Ian Wright. Yes. Now, I thought I had Ian Wright on the back of this one because I can just picture Ian Wright wearing this shirt. Yeah, and then number eight again. Yeah, that scene he pressed on. That looks very good. Stitching on the sleeves. Yeah, I can't see any loose red in at all at the moment. This is just absolutely spot on at the moment. Of course, we'll turn it inside out in a minute. Yeah, your usual tags there, Arsenal, yeah, we'll turn it inside out now. This is where we usually notice the flaws, but so far, everything looks spot on with it. Just have a look at the sides. Wow, just so far, absolutely amazing. The stitching so far is spot on. I I can't fault it at all. Spot on, man. I really can't fault it at all. I'm going to look on this link as well. Oh, just a sign of it there, but hardly anything at all. This has got to be one of the best on her DH skate shirts I have her bought so far. Let's turn it this way round. Let's have a look. Tiny bit there, but again, hardly anything to worry about. This side. Tiny bit there. But you would think this is a genuine football shirt. There's hardly any loose stitching at all. For a remake, this is superb. The material. 
Wow, you can hardly see my fingers. This is absolutely top jewel stuff. It really is. Wow, wow, wow. I'm going to say this now. Probably the best ever shirt I have bought on the DH Gate. <laughs> That is absolutely superb. I absolutely love it. Always liked the Breeze Banana Kit. So, yep, always wanted it in my collection. It's just an outstanding football shirt. The colour of it, everything about it, love it. Now, on the football club, I do football club on a Monday evening. And someone who is a Tottenham Hotspur fan... Wants me to wear it there as a one-off. So I agreed to. So one Monday evening I'm going to be wearing this uh, football club. So that's going to be an interesting reaction. But there are a few Arsenal supporters there. So oh, I can't wait to hear their reaction. But yeah, delighted to have this in my collection. As I said, probably the best ever shirt I bought on the DH Skates. Long it, absolutely long it. If you're a football shirt collector, this is a must. I mean, just the badge and everything. I mean, what's a badge? That small no on the authentic ones, I, I don't know, but it's certainly this is one nice shirt. Comment your calls down below, I will always reply. And I have more football shirts on the way. Thank you. Plenty more videos to come. Bye-bye.